Hello everyone, hope you are doing well. This is a project demonstration video. Recently, I developed this website. This is a booking website where user can book a playground for a particular time for their kids. So there will be like three types of booking. First one is the social play. This social play will be available for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. When Friday uh, will have like two slots, Saturday and Sunday will have like four slots. So if you see, if I click on 25th. And this is friday 25th august and like we have two slots and each slot will have like 30 seats and you can see the first slot have like 26 seat available and rest is already booked so if i click on if i try to book again so i click i uh, click on the slot then click on confirm date and time then i need to log in so i already have a lot account so i will log in with that After I logged in, uh, it's showing my information over here and it asked me to add kids information who will attend the social play. So let's say I add one kid, if his age, relation, and agree with the viewer. Then each kid will cost like 12.5 USD. If I want to add parents, you can also add here, and the parent will cost 3.5 USD. So total is calling me 17 USD. Now if you want to pay, so if I click on pay and book, so this is connected to the Stripe. So let's put a demo Stripe account. Click on pay now. Doing payment successful but pending is refresh. You can see it's saying pay. This was the previous one, but this is the current one. So if you click on view details, saying this is paid from the booking time the date as well as the guest list like milan this is me the account and then the my kid this is the kid information age and relation the kid parent and the information okay so this is how the social play is working okay this one now if i click on 25 again you can see like we have like 23 previously it was 26 and then uh, we got like three more if you click on profile we'll we can see like all the bookings here we got total three guests so 26 minus 3 so now it's 23 okay so this is how the social play is working now let's talk about the party booking so party will have multiple packages currently we are in awesome package there are some uh, more packages you can set uh, price based on the package so for awesome we'll have like 400 usd you can set another package called i guess tabular yeah so it's 500 usd so based on the package the time and the price will be different okay and the um, party is available for monday to thursday okay let's say i choose 21 and have like four slot here this is similar to the like social play uh, let's say i choose this slot you can confirm and here actually we can um, add the guest so i already already showing my information and then i want to add new case so click on here the guest name so let's say get guest one at the age 12 and here actually the age is important because if the age is less than uh, 18 that means it's a kid and if it's um, more than 18 that or 18 or more than 18 that means it's an adult so you can give a relation here and more guest The age is 19. This is adult. Let's say twice or something like that. And another here we have like another feature. So this is kind of like your own family. And these are like if you want to um, ask someone, uh, some other family to join the party. Okay. So for that, what you will do, you will give the the other family's parent information here. So let's say other parent and how much adult guests they are allowed to bring so let's say two how much kids they are allowed to bring let's say um, three and enter their email address so now i just put my email address and this is fine and now it's showing that uh, like total we have like 30 seats if you see in the top like this package includes 20 guests okay. so 
20 guests will put charge like 500 USD or the based on the package 400 500 USD and after that if you uh, exceed the uh, limit of 20 guests that time it will cost extra so let's say instead of let's say we put let's say instead of 2 we put like 20 guests as an adult now you can see we have posted available still but you can see in the uh, cost of extra payment there is some extra payment so cost of the package is 500 USD that's fine cost of the total kids there is no extra kids so that is zero and cost of extra parent that is total you have six parents for 21 USD extra 21 USD you need to pay okay. instead of let's say you give it two and let's make it like third 20 or 25 now now we have like four key four adult which is like 14 USD and six adult six extra kids which is like 71 USD so total will be like 535 USD okay so if there is like more than 20 people that time actually will give like it will, it will cost extra and if you make it like one more if you see we have like zero it available if I make it 26 think that you can add like more than 30 kids please remove one so we'll just make it like this now if I click on pay and book so you must agree on the waiver so again agree then pay and book this is a similar payment method so just choose the example one click on pay now now we have like party and it's pending if you refresh once this will be paid this is paid you click on the view details for the party so we have like milan guest these are like my family and these are like invite list now if you check this email so let me open my inbox okay so i got the email so you can say hi other parent you got an invite this is the date and time everything so if i click on this invite it is asking me to log in so i don't have any account so let's create one so let's say uh, guest put my email give the phone number give the phone number the password so login successful now you can fill up the form and accept the invitation so at kids info you can add six so this is the like max limit we have provided while inviting him so let's add a few more so let's say kid of other parent provide a kid age his son if you want to add we can add three adult for now i'm just adding one so x one adult guest relation with let's say watch and then i agree and accept invite and we accepted invites so now if i click on my profile and invites you can see so i accept the invite from milan okay and if i view my profile party so this invite list the invite is accepted so this is how the um, party booking is working and like invitation and everything okay okay so after that the last one would be uh, the summer camp so here actually from the dashboard we create the camp list and this will be kind of like weekly uh, booking we can actually define the date from which uh, the start date and end date in the summer camp we are actually providing like uh, four hours around so 8 to 12 pm so if i select this one or select this one whatever we are select we need to pass the key information here so let's say we pass the key as a demo on kit let's say the age let's say nine so the age max can be 10 here okay so select this one and after that we need to log in first to look i think i'm already logged in let me refresh the page yeah so i'm already logged in so click here and so kid name is let's say nine okay so i choose this one and click on pay now same process now i got a summer camp here in my profile so the status is pending if i click refresh it will be paid 
yeah so this is showing the time and and the date the key information okay so the bookings we can view all the parties and social pay in the invites we can view my, our own invites i mean in the invites we can view the invitations and in the summer camp we can actually view the summer camp booking so the settings actually we can do the logout and we can view our information um, let's uh, log out from here and login as admin so after you logged in so you can see the like total income till now and total summer camp income this one social plan party income this is the social play and party income this is the summer camp income and this is the total income we can add more in future if needed the booking so you can actually see based on the date like this is the party booking happening on 21 25th i guess yeah in the 25th we have like two okay and if uh, someone actually didn't pay you like maybe one or two hours you can actually delete them here so that slot is available again and someone else can book that thing and in the you can see the view details also the same the guest list and status and time summer camp you can view the summer camp booking paid and everything and in the all week section now we can actually create new week okay. and these two weeks we have been created for summer camp so you can create new if needed you can update and edit you can delete okay so this is how actually the whole thing is working with three types of booking one was like social play another one as party and another one as summer camp so all the payments uh, are actually handling in the stripe so if you go to payments in stripe you can see like all the payments is today like 21 august today is 21 august you can see like 100 usd 400 400 500 50 so all the things we have done till now so all the payments are successful so thank you everyone if you are new to my channel feel free to subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for new videos it will help me to grow also it will encourage me to create more videos like this so see you in the next video